All right, guys. I'm pretty sure I showed you how to run the box on flats. I don't remember, but I don't think there was any butt joints, or not a lot of them. So I'm just gonna make a video about how I run the box. And remember, when I do the flats, I don't use my wheels. I lock the box and I leave the wall just far enough away from the wheels that it doesn't make a mess. But now I'll show you how to do the, 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 bot, uh, the butt joints. So I run it wide open, unless there's too many pinholes. That means it's filling that side a lot. So you can leave them there if it's really bad. Some spots I even touched up by hand just to make a little bit nicer for when I box them out. So first thing I do is I start on zero and I don't use the wheels. I will start, okay, I'll start the box not on the edge of my flap. I will go right up to the edge of the bevel. So I'm really starting my butt joint two, three inches into that wet mud, which is why I do all my flats in the room first, then I come back and do all the butt joints. So hopefully it's dry a little bit. So I'll run one way on wide open, okay, edge of the bevel, and go the other way and take off the edge on the edge of the bevel. And then I do the other side, same thing. Now with that box there, I'll just stop at the box and start after. Okay, now you could even just put a little arch around it like this. Okay, and then I start crooked and I straighten it out. That's not bad at all. Like those little crusties that are left from the box could be avoided just by wiping your box with your finger, your edges, okay? But you just keep doing that and it goes pretty quick. Like I could do both sides one way, okay? Clean my box a little bit and bolt the other way. It just eliminates the chances of pinholes, especially on butt joints, because you have more mud than a flat. You're, you're building it out, okay? And when the butt joint is really small, like maybe above this door, I'll just run it down the center. And the next coat, I'll do by hand, because it'll turn out much better and it'll be done. Compared to with the box, I could run a 12 inch box on it, it won't be done. All right guys, so that's what I do with boxing. I do the flat first, and then I do the butt joints, all right?